What's going on guys? It's Simon from SG and today we're going to go over some of my favorite things that we've done at SG Web Partners with Gravity Forms. So a lot of people, you know, when they might be hating on WordPress um, or whatever, and I just think Gravity Forms is such a great uh, plugin, probably one of the, maybe one of the best plugins ever made for Word, WordPress. That could be a really bold take, um, but maybe we'll run with it. So the first one I want to say is like quizzes. So quizzes with Gravity Forms. This is an example we did for this golf workout program website. Um, if you click start here, you kind of go through this quiz where you can select your gender, um, see what score you're trying to break consistently for golf, and then you know you get um, you can add in your your first name and your email, and um, that's using Gravity Forms. The quiz throughout the progress is, is leading Gravity Forms, so um, kind of cool. The second example is request a quote, request a sample. So a lot of people think like, oh, you know, forms only for like contact us forms, um, you know, but you need to think of a form as like so much more than that, right? So this is an example for this electric component website we've done where you can click, let's just go to this one, let's click a component like here. So let's say I want to request a sample or I want to request a quote. Um, I could click here and I could, you know, choose my quantity and I can enter in my name, you know, test company, example, example, and um, submit a quote request. Another example is you could use it to kind of do like an e-commerce calculator quiz and you could go through an entire um, like kind of if this then that conditional fields to get uh, like a result. So right here we're trying to give people a estimate of how much their e-commerce website could cost. So. Anyway, so you can go through this and um, you know you enter in your email and you know you can get a value based on what people filled out. Um, so it's kind of another fun thing you can do with Gravity Forms. The next one you can do is you could do something like you know a subscribe to our newsletter, and you also could just do like the generic. Um, contact us. So this is another site on Fannies that we did where we have contact us. And that's what a lot of people probably think like those forms are for. But as you just saw with the quiz, the kind of the project costing slash like cost estimate form, the, you know, request a sample or request a quote and the newsletter sign up. Those are all examples of stuff you can do in Gravity Forms. And I would really recommend looking at the plugin if you want to look at the get the link to the plugin look below in the bio and yeah hope you guys love this video give me a thumbs up if you did and i'm um, trying to do a new video every week so i'll be back in a little bit and yeah peace out guys